Oh, what's on my face? Hey guys, welcome to today's video. My name is Ajane. For those of you who are new, I am a medical social worker. I work in an OB clinic and um, when my patients deliver, then I follow them over to the hospital. So, yay. Um, I wanted to do like a morning in my life um, because why not? I filmed yesterday a um, like what happens after work and there's like really no strict structure to my mornings and my nights like before work and after work. But a lot of things do stay the same. I do wake up, I do use the restroom, I do brush my teeth. It's like one of the first things I have to do, those two things. And then I ended up getting dressed, doing my hair, and getting all prepared. And now, oh, also what was strange this morning was if you watched the previous video, what happens after work, then you would know, um, we'll be able to follow this. But like the patient that I was working with yesterday, she had like texted me that she had her husband um, agreeable to taking her to the methadone clinic. So I followed up with her this morning because she texted me like 6.30 and I just need to have boundaries and like a work-life balance. Let me turn you guys. Work-life balance. So I didn't respond back until this morning at about like 7.15. And I was just like verifying with her. I was like, are you sure? Because I don't want to cancel the cab. Um, you know, I just want to make sure that he's actually going to take you. And she was like, actually, I'm in route. So I was messaging her back and forth. And then I ended up canceling the cab. And then I just finished my note. Um, so yeah, I have a patient. I wasn't going to go in until about 10.30 because I have a patient at 11 o'clock. Um, and then I have a few patients later on um, sprinkled out the rest of the day until about two o'clock in the afternoon. So I wasn't going to really do too much. But because we added on a new patient, um, I'm going to just try go and try to check in with her because she was mine her previous pregnancy. So in the process now of making me a matcha. So I thought I would take you guys along for that. Hopefully you can see me because I can't see myself. But let's get into it. Okay, here's my little tea drawer. It was organized, but I messed it up yesterday. But I'm gonna finish this. I use the Chamberlain Coffee Matcha, and I really prefer the regular one, which is why I have it. Um, this one's empty, and I have one at work that I keep there, and then I'm trying Alfred's Matcha. Um, I need to just try it by itself because I usually mix my matcha with like Miralax and collagen. So, got that. I'm gonna, sorry for the quality, guys. But um, I think I'm gonna have, I don't know what kind of matcha I want. That's the problem. Is I don't remember if I want a cold matcha or a warm matcha because today is like in the 70s, although it's like summer. So, so here are the two items that I use and I'm one of those people who likes to see my matcha like I want to see the color and everything so the vanilla matcha from Chamberlain comes in a bag which I'm not sure why because the regular matcha doesn't come in a bag which I think just makes it messy but maybe I was supposed to dump it out but anyway I like my matcha pretty strong so I do a good heap of it just a little more and fortunately, which is something that doesn't really happen, is I didn't eat lunch yesterday. I went early. So I didn't eat my lunch. I just left it there in the fridge so that I could eat it today. So I'm just going to take a scoop of the um, unflavored vital proteins collagen. Oops. And then I'm going to do one packet of Miralax. Like as you get older, you need a little assistance sometimes <laughs> to make things are, make sure things are flowing, right? Okay, and then I boiled my hot water and I'm gonna put just a little in there to kind of break things up. And to me, this makes like the matcha really, really green, as you can see. So I have to make sure that this is really mixed up. So I'm gonna do that and then I'll check back in a little bit. Does anybody have any like strong, like I feel like this is, really good when it's at the top like when she's a nitty-gritty like i have a I have three different products in here she can take a little bit a little minute to kind of spurts up a little bit so does anyone have like a really strong one because i can just take this one and keep it at work but let me know because i'm still mixing <laughs> okay and it's you know not this fall 
No one told me to put like three thick things in here. Actually, I actually have to wash this soap. Okay, so next I'm gonna add a little bit of agave. And then I buy the um, Alfred vanilla syrup. So I'm gonna give that a good shake because it has vanilla bean in it. I actually need to order some more before they sell out. And then it's weeks before I get another one. So I do about that much. And I use the Giovanni oat milk extra cream. Give that a little shake. And I go until my heart says stop. I'm gonna give her a little stir. And for some reason, the ice at my job, it's like the Sonic, more like pellet ice, but I just don't, I don't like her. I don't know why. I think it's like the filtered water that just already tastes weird. Like I already don't drink that. So I'm just gonna have a tap of the water. I normally don't. She's a little thick today. And then I'm gonna add some ice cubes. She's a little lukewarm. She needs some more agave. Not too much, not too much. Mm. That's it. Okay, so let me put all this stuff up. Struggling today. Hey, hey, hey. Ouch! Someone's cut me. Just drew blood. What the heck did I ever do to you? Something about the creamy oat milk. Okay guys, so I started working from home a little bit this morning because like I told you, I was talking with that patient and I wanted to chart as soon as possible that I did talk to her and that, you know, she said what she said. And so I am, I just finished up looking at the schedule, just checking everything and I'm gonna put this up and I'm gonna get my stuff and we're gonna go head into the office. And it sucks because it's like one of those rainy, chilly summer days. So I would prefer to continue to sit on the couch and work, but to the office we go. But before that, I'm going to take a B12 because I take B12 shots, but I only do them monthly now. So I'm trying to get my levels up. <laughs> so I don't, I don't have to give myself shots the rest of my life. I don't really have a problem taking pills, like never, but yeah. show you guys my outfit really quick i got this sweater from shein this blouse is from target um i have on these black jeans black pants from uh, either kohl's or macy's and then i have on these knockoff pink kids to go with the summer spring look and yeah into work we go <laughs>
lately I've been putting on my badge before I leave like park and stuff. So I just have this so I just have this basic social work badge and I'm gonna put this on so that I don't forget it. And we're heading out. It's raining. Ugh. Ugh. So do you guys like these types of videos? Do you want to see like a full day in my life? Do you want to see more of what I do outside of work? Because I used to vlog like very frequently. Um, but I kind of stopped because those videos weren't performing nearly as well as like the social work content. So I just stopped posting because I just figured that it was a lot of energy and a lot of time and I didn't need to be spending or allocating that time editing and filming videos that weren't performing well. But if you guys now want to see more of who I am as a person outside of work, then I'm more than happy to have like spurts of these types of videos here and there. But I really just wanted to like do some different content that inspired me um, and that I was like excited to film. So I came up with this like on the fly. And she's worked out, you know, like. We'll see, we'll see how it goes. Um, I wanna do a vlog where it's like from a Friday or the last day I work, because sometimes I only work like four days out of the week. So I can do like a Friday and then like following up on how I start to follow up from like what I left off on Friday. So I think that that will be a cool idea to try and to film. And I just need to remember like start Friday, start again Monday, <laughs> finish. So yeah, those are my thoughts more recently. Um, I have hopefully some exciting news to share with you guys. This person is not well <laughs> driving. Um, I hope to share. I hope to share some exciting news with you guys in the next few videos. Um, but yeah, we'll see. Here we go. Okay, so one of the first things I do is put my book back up, put my trash can back, and log into the computer. So. I usually log into the computer and make sure that this isn't red, this light right here, because that lets me know if I have a voicemail, so I don't have any voicemails. Or missed calls then I just start to open up my email and I want some notes out so I'm just checking my email since I left home making sure that nothing is urgent I'm gonna open up the schedule to see if there is anyone here or if anybody went to the hospital in the 20 minutes that it took me to get here but yeah this is pretty much my morning usually i'll put up my lunch but like i said i left it here <laughs> so i don't really have anything extra to do um so the patient we have three patients here no, two, one's telemedicine. So we have the two patients here. I'm gonna go check in with my coworker to see how things are going for her. And yeah. But if you're like, I mean, at that point, you're like, maybe they think abiding. Not, you're I'm like, glad company, so I'm gonna do Yeah, that. I mean, but I would think that at that point, you're law abiding, you would think. So right here, I'm just making myself my breakfast. I just have bagel and some toppings, but I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching the video. This basically concludes it. I'm just going to show you my bagel and then I close out the video. But if you guys like to see more videos like this, please, please, please let me know because I wouldn't know otherwise. This is my first time doing something like this um, in relation to like my personal life and work. So yeah, I hope that you guys still enjoyed it and I hope you guys are doing well and I'll see you in the next video.
all right guys it's 10 33 and i'm gonna end the video here if you like this video please make sure you give it a thumbs up anyway i wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching the video if you like this type of video please make sure that you thumbs it up you comment down below and i'll see you in the next one bye guys